Tonight we are in the thick of the Christmas travel rush. Today and tomorrow are going to be the two busiest days with 115 million Americans traveling. We've got Lauren Costa keeping an eye on things over at Indianapolis International. So Lauren, how busy has it been at the airport today? Well, Scott, right now, tonight, things have slowed down a little bit. It was busy earlier, but let me tell you, the airport is getting everyone in the holiday spirit. We have a whole choir on stage right now singing all the hits. We have a giant tree in the concourse decorated for the holidays. And honestly, this year, it's not too hard to get people in the holiday spirit because there are no canceled flights tonight, only a few delays, which is a big difference compared to this time last year. Also, just a little bit ago, I checked in with airport officials. They tell me they are expecting nearly 15,000 people to come through Indy just today alone. And tomorrow they are calling for more than 17,000. And we know a lot of these travelers are visiting family for the holidays. So we caught up with one family who reunited with their daughter after she is serving in the Navy and also a couple ready to see family in California. <laughs> It means absolutely the world to me to be home with my family for the holidays. I've been gone for like nine months. I can't say enough words, just her dedication to everything and just her love for her country and love for her family. No ice, no rain, no snow. So I am, God is good. We are, Santa's sleigh is coming, Santa's coming too, so it's all looking good. And today we also saw a lot of people picking up loved ones. So if that is you, the airport suggests waiting in the cell phone lot first until the flight arrives. After that, you can pull up to arrivals or park and come to the main concourse. But as of tonight, so far, so good over here for TSA. We're looking at just four minutes for gate B, which is nothing compared to earlier. We saw about 17, 20 minutes. So looking pretty good right now. And also if you're flying tomorrow, don't you worry. Our Samantha Johnson will be here bright and early reporting everything you need to know on sunrise. But for now, Scott, back to you. Yeah, glad things are calm right now. If people are leaving tomorrow, get there early. Lauren Kostick, thanks so much. <laughs> and if you'd like to learn more about the holiday travel surge, we've got it for you right now on WTHR.com.